Federal officials had anticipated that threats would only grow as the election cycle ramps up, but they are still alarming. This is 37-year-old Kyle Alton Hall. Federal authorities in Tennessee say Hall made several posts on X on July 27th. They say in these posts, Hall threatened to kill, assassinate, shoot, and crash the plane of President Biden and assassinate Vice President Harris and former President Obama. If convicted, he could face up to 15 years in prison. Former President Trump also became the subject of yet another threat the police say was made on social media, too. Cochise County Police in Arizona say 66-year-old Ronald Lee Sevroid made two posts on August 21st and August 22nd. They allege the message had language indicating harm against Trump. The manhunt for Sevroid on Thursday unfolded as Trump was in the state visiting the U.S.-Mexico border. These threats come in the middle of what the Department of Homeland Security and the FBI have described as a heightened threat environment. Federal, state, and local agencies are boosting efforts to prevent political violence against candidates, election workers, and other high-profile figures. In Washington, Mather Rivera, Fox News.